What is up YouTube, jborn2024 here, and today we're going to be doing a let's build on a house. As you can see, I've already built it twice. Um, I keep having problems, I don't know what the deal is, my computer keeps running hot. <clears throat> but today's subscriber of the video is Anthony Webb, appreciate you being subscribed. The blocks we're going to be needing for this build is light gray stained clay, cracked stone bricks, pillared quartz, stone brick slabs, stone bricks, um, stone brick stairs, quartz stairs, <clears throat> block of quartz, and black stained glass. We'll also need black stained glass panes. <clears throat> so let's go ahead and get started. First we're going to work on the front part of the build. So we're going to grab our light gray stained clay and we're going to go two across. We're going to build this up uh, five high for now. Then we're going to grab our pillared quartz and we're just going to take that one layer five high. And then we'll do two sideways pillared quartz. This is just going to be a window frame. So we'll go ahead and place our black stained glass panes inside of that window frame. After we have that built, we'll go one wide and five high with the gray stained clay. Next we'll be making a door frame, so we're going to grab our pillared quartz. Oops, and we're going to go five high. And then in these middle blocks we'll place sideways pillared quartz. And there's our door frame. For the doors, I'm gonna be using acacia doors, so I'm gonna go ahead and place those in. And then above the doors, I'm going to use the black stained glass. Once we have the frame built, we'll go with a light gray stained clay, one wide. And then we'll go with the pillared quartz and two sideways in the middle on the bottom and top. And then one pillared quartz all the way up. So after we have that, we'll go with two wide with the light, light gray stained clay and we'll just go over the top of all this with the light gray one layer once we have that we'll go ahead and start working on the porch so we're going to come out we'll make it even with the uh, doors we'll go ahead and fill this in also and we're going to bring that four out with the stone brick slabs so this is three and four. We're gonna leave this corner place empty because we're gonna make like a column going up. And then we'll also leave it empty where this light gray is. And empty where that is. And like so. So in this corner, we're gonna go three high with the cracked stone brick. And where the light gray is, we'll go three high. Same here. And in this corner. Once we have that three high, we'll go over the top of the pillared quartz upright, two. Then we can grab our quartz stairs and we can make them upside down. We're just going to build this all the way around the porch. I apologize if you can hear the uh, computer fan in the background. I turned it up to make it maybe not run so hot. Alright, so then we're going to grab our stone brick slabs and we're going to make a fence railing. If you would prefer to use like glass panes here, you can, or fences, you can. But I'm just going to use the uh, stone brick slabs. We're also going to make a stair going up to the front porch. Or the front door. Then we'll finish the railing. Once we have that, we're going to fill in the ceiling of the front porch. I'm going to use uh, the block of quartz. You can use whatever block you prefer. But we'll go ahead and fill all this in. And there we go. Almost. Alright, now that we have that filled in, that is pretty much the front of the build. So we're going to go ahead and start working on the right side. 
We're going to grab our light gray stain clay and we're going to go across five here. So we already have one, two, three, four, and five. And we'll build that up all the way until it meets with the upside down stair. Once we have that, we'll grab our pillared quartz. We're just gonna make one block five high. And then we will go nine out from the pillared quartz with the light gray. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And we'll build this up until it's even with the upside down stairs. Alright, so then we'll grab our pillared quartz and we'll just go one, five high. And then we'll grab our light gray and we'll go out five. So one, two, three, four, and five. And we'll build that all the way up until it's going to meet with the upside down stairs. So once we have that built, we can grab our court stairs and just take this all the way until it meets the front. We're going to leave this empty and no window because we're going to place a fireplace going up like a chimney. Alright, so once we have that, we can go ahead and start working on this back wall. We're going to take one light gray stained clay all the way up. And then we'll grab our pillared quartz and we're going to go one all the way up and then two sideways and then one all the way up. We'll leave one layer here because we need to go with light gray over the top. So I'm just going to go ahead and do that. It's probably not far enough, but it's okay. To the right of this uh, pillar of quartz, we're going to go with one layer five high of the light gray. And then we'll make another door frame. So we'll go with one layer, the pillar of quartz, two sideways, and another layer frame and we'll go with one layer of light gray stained clay then we'll make another window frame so we'll go with one layer of the pillar quartz all the way up two sideways and one up and then after that we'll go with two light gray stained clay it should look like that so we'll go ahead and fill in the windows with the glass panes of your choice Grab some acacia doors, place two here. Actually, no, we're not going to place doors there. We're going to leave this. We're going to, uh, I apologize, I'm going to fill this in. This back wall in here, where the door was in the front, we're just going to leave this blank so we can have uh, more rooms in here. We're actually going to make the doors here. We're going to have two doors in the back. We'll place the glass, the block of glass here, and then two doors. I apologize about that. Alright, so now that we have that, we'll go ahead and start working on the back porch. So we'll grab our stone bricks and we'll make it even with the acacia doors. And we're going to bring this four out. We'll leave this corner piece empty. And I can't remember how many we go across. So we're going to do this three high here. And then we're going to skip maybe one, two, three, four, five, six. And then we'll place them here. One, two, three, four, five, six. And we'll just have it like that. That's fun. Then we'll take our pillared quartz, two high above the cracked stone. Then we'll grab our upside down stairs and we'll just take this all the way around the porch. So, and we can make our railing. And actually, we're going to make this here. So, instead of six, we're going to have four in between. Apologize about that, but 
I don't I don't like it there so <laughs> so we're gonna have four so that's two four so it should go here and then we'll make some stairs going up <clears throat> I'll fill this in like so I'll take this up too and then we'll fill in the roof with quartz or whichever block you use whoops so we'll just go ahead and fill in all this I'm probably just gonna do the front I mean the bottom floor in this episode because last time I recorded after I got past 15 minutes it just started messing up I think my computer started running too hot so we're just gonna get the front or the bottom floor done in this episode so we'll go ahead and work on this wall. We're gonna do basically the same thing as we did over there, but we're gonna put a window in the middle. So we're going to go five across, so we already have one, two, three, four, and five. We'll build this up, whoops. Until it's even with the stairs. Then we'll go with one pillar quartz all the way up. Then we'll go with nine light gray, so two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We'll just build this up all the way until it's even with the upside down stairs. All right, and then we'll go with the pillar quartz all the way up. And this should be five, so one, two, three, four, and five. Then we'll grab our upside down stairs take this all the way across if I can place it right and then we're gonna place a window here so we're gonna have two stained uh, gray on each side and we're going to just knock out knock out all this until it's even with the stairs and then we'll place court stairs going up all the way there in each corner and then in between we'll make them sideways and then we'll just fill in all that with the glass panes and there's our window all right so after we have this you can go ahead and you can um, grab a fence I'm going to grab the oak fence and then I'm gonna grab a beacon. We're gonna place a fence here and here, and then place a beacon under it so it lights up the porch. And then we'll do the same thing in the back on each side of the doors. We'll place an oak fence. And then we'll place a beacon under it. And there we go. There's our front and back porches done. So I'm going to end the episode now because I don't want to run it to 15 minutes and take the chance of the video messing up again because I've already tried to record twice. So we're going to leave off here and then part two we'll start working on the roof and uh, try to get the roof and the second floor done and then uh, part three we'll start working on the like floor plan and stuff. But if you enjoyed it, make sure to hit the like button, uh, comment or leave your suggestions and feedback in the comments and subscribe for more let's builds that's going to be all hope you guys have a great day and peace